So welcome to astragalus. <clears throat> this is an extraordinary tonic herb. It's now becoming more and more famous the world over. It's obviously, it's one of the 50 fundamental herbs in traditional Chinese medicine. So from an energetic standpoint, this herb is top of the hill, <laughs> top drawer. And uh, it's famous for qi. Qi, qi, qi. This is a word we toss around. We all act like we know what it means. And I want to dive into it just a little bit more to give you more insight. So this is an herb that martial artists use to rejuvenate and build muscle. It's an herb that is known for tonifying qi. And now qi is this idea of energy. That's how we typically, you know, translate it in the West, but it has a lot of meanings. And this is the sort of qi that is particularly identified with the whole idea of what you breathe in, so this is going to help open and strengthen the lungs, but it's also going to go right to your stomach and spleen. Those two are paired together in traditional Chinese medicine. And it's this idea of the, the qi that you get from food and sustenance and that that's most material. So you have this most etheric and you have this most material coming together and astragalus is tonifying both those systems. Um, it's very well known for tonifying what we know as Wei Qi, and Wei Qi is this idea of defensive Qi. So Qi is this overarching principle in Taoism and in traditional Chinese medicine. At the most esoteric level, it is where there is no duality, right? No yin and yang anymore. Qi. Qi is everywhere. It's in rocks. It's in your food. It's in your environment. It's in your relationships. It's the basis of feng shui. How is the energy flowing? What are you attracting to you? What are you repelling? What are you protecting yourself from? All this idea. These are all qi's. Breath. Qi. Right? Qi, qi, qi. Once you dive down from qi, you get this idea of duality. Yin and yang. Right? It encompasses it. There's yang qi. Right? <laughs> so there's qi, and stragglus is this tonic herb that comes in and tonifies qi. So it's going to do it physically. It's going to do this idea of wei qi, which is your, sort of your external qi in your body. It's the part that protects you from external invasions, and that can mean germs and colds and flus, so really building the immune system. This is, from the Western point of view, an adaptogenic herb which means it's also going to protect you from stressors that can wear you down and make you susceptible to, you know, every, you know, every six weeks, like clockwork, you're catching a cold, um, you can't get rid of your flu, can't get rid of, you know, an, any illness you've had, you're not really recovering, um, you're an athlete and want to get stronger, you're going to be thinking astragalus because it's going to build this chi. It's going to really help fortify you and nourish you. And it's this great one that you can toss in soups. We have so many, our healing herb course on it. Oh my gosh, we talk about all these great ways to cook with it. It's got this wonderful sweet flavor. What a surprise. We're not talking sugar. We're talking the kind of sweet that is used in traditional Chinese medicine as an herbal reference to the quality of sweetness in the root itself, right? A root, can you get any more nourishing than that? That sweet comes in and nourishes the body. It's the big nourishing flavor. So this is astragalus. If you've got anything going on with qi, whether you're feeling like you're kind of weak mental emotionally, um, that you're just sort of flatlining, Astragalus is going to help build you up and fortify you, give you the strength to take that next step, give you the strength to walk out your front door, keep you safe, right? Help your boundaries, your wage sheet, your defensive chi be strong. Not so that you're on guard all the time and your adrenals are being shot. No, so that you're clear. This is me, this is you, my boundaries. And this is all a matter of chi. And you know this because you know there's certain people that can walk into a room and they're just magnetic. They got that kind of chi. There's other people that like, no, 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 not going to talk to that person. I'm going over here. A stragglist. It's going to build your chi. And it's delicious, and it's easy to add to foods, and it's easy to enjoy in a wide variety of ways, from tablets to teas, wonderful in tea, to soups and stews. So you got no reason to be adding some astragalus into your daily regimen. It's an herb built for longevity. It's a tonic herb. Make you healthy and glow and have cheese.